Hello everyone and welcome to this series of videos called Coding Challenges in Serial Monitor. Okay, so these are going to be basically uh, um, not a set of tutorials but a set of challenges where I show you guys uh, a desired output or a desired program characteristics and you try to achieve it. Of course I will print and publish the solutions. Now the idea behind this is that, well, some of my students after 10, 20 hours of, of tutorials get all the way advanced as far as building circuits. They've got no trouble with them whatsoever, but they're still struggling a little bit with the coding. So if you go through these challenges, you're pretty much going to cover the basics rather well. You will also learn to use the serial monitor. Um, it's a very handy tool uh, when it comes to you know debugging, uh, investigating what's going on with your program, getting extra information out of your sensors and out of the Arduino. So you learn to use the serial monitor pretty well. Um, and going through the tutorials, I'll just go through what they are going to be. You're also going to learn uh, to create algorithms quite well. And in a few of them, you're going to get uh, up against the processing limits of the Arduino and so you will learn to optimize. So these are going to be the first six. I've already created these. Um, I probably intend to make about 12 in total but first uh, and, and the first three are basically for, for beginners. For people that have done less than 10 hours the first one is you develop a counter and you print out the numbers. Second is you develop a countdown timer. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Countdown complete. Um, the next one is you build a clock that tells the correct time. I suggest um, if you already are familiar with Arduino, you probably start with this one. Um, after that, we do some maths. Uh, we write a program that tests if a number is odd or even. Uh, a number that tests uh, whether a number is a prime number or not. And if not, uh, we could print out the factors of that. And finally, reversing the number. You enter a number and the program gives you the reverse of it. Now, of course, this is a challenge for you to develop all of these programs your own way. I will publish my own solutions and to get into the challenges, simply click on the one you feel like doing. Thank you very much.